how to make echo reverb perfect inside DaVinci Resolve. To make this work you need to cut down your music at least a tiny bit so you can have some leftover music. Then go one or two seconds before the end of it and make a cut. You can either use the razor blade right here or use the command B or control B. Then make a duplicate of that leftover part and extend it by a tiny bit. A few seconds should work. It should be looking something around like this. Then you wanna highlight this second part which is on audio channel number 2 and you wanna head over to effects in effects library and in the search bar you can type reverb. Select audio effects and there you will find the reverb on which you wanna use it on your second media. Then you wanna make the room size in here to about 60 squares. You should be looking around the values in here. So once you made it around 60, you want to increase the reverb time to maximum and then close this one. Next up, you need to highlight the second one and open the inspector on the right side. Select the audio and you can reduce it. Leave a values of minus 12 for example, then highlight the second part, which is the audio number one. And you can reduce the values in there to minus two. Then you can grab the faders right here and take it down so you can make an easing out curve looking something like this. And then you can do similar to the first one, but not so much, just a tiny bit, just like this. And now let's preview our final result, so we can see what we're having. I hope it was helpful, you can also watch this video right here, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.